Hello, beautiful family. How are you all doing? Thank you for the love and the support. So, my beautiful people, today I have a quick one to share with you, okay? Hmm. You guys know progress, the analyst that I always bring the update to you back to back. Remember, in this platform, I promise you, I will take the word to your doorstep. You don't need to bother because that is one reason why you have me. So, you guys know that I'll be giving you update about Barista Ifani Asia for. Recently, we heard what happened when he raised alarm that his life is in danger, that people should watch. He measured his community and leaders that they are the ones that are after his life. A lot of things has been happening up and down to an extent that some group are saying that they should look into the case of Barista Ifani Ejofo. Anyways, I know that a lot of people are going to tell me to present it very well that Barista Ifani Ejofo is no longer... Lead counsel to Mazi in Abdekanu because, according to the report, we gather that he has been sacked by the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazi Abdekanu himself. You guys know that February 8th, this month, will be the cost sharing again for Mazi in Abdekanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra. We are going to see how everything is going to play. We are going to know if truly Barrister Ifa is your first still invoke or not. Anyways, the court hearing for December 15, 2023, we had what happened that he did not feel sure in any of the activity inside the court and outside the court. Anyway, he is not the only one. He is not the only one, including Barrister Mike Ezekume. But you guys know that Mazna Adekano will be appearing in court on 18th of February this month and we are going to get all the updates more better and dish out to you accordingly. Now we are going to see what is really happening and what they have said concerning uh, Barista Ifan is your fault and why the community leaders say, oh, they should go after him that is the one that is causing insecurity in Biafra land. Now hear the news in details. Leaders of O. Oh, Orafete community in Ekusigo local government area of Anabra State have accused the council to Mazi in Abdekano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Barista Mike Ezekome, of encouraging insecurity in the community. In a press conference by past and present leadership of the community, including the traditional rulers, the community said. Ifa in age of four has been in the habit of recruiting young youths of the community and using them to perpetrate violence. Hey, President General of the community, Mr. Vin Dike, who addressed journalists on behalf of the leadership of the community, said, You may have read in the media recently about barrister Ifa in age of four claiming that our sons, Sir Emeka, plans to assassinate him. Those are all lies. We want to tell you that Barista Ifa Ejofo is the biggest problem we have in Orefeti. He is the cause of insecurity in our community. And he used IPOB to terrorize us. <laughs> of course, you know that his best known address is that he is the counsel to Mazi in Abdikanu. Hey, hey. We called you here today to tell you that Orefete, as a community, has decided to suspend until further notice two significant cultural festivals, Otu Ike and Otu Ubi. This is because it has contributed to insecurity in the community and today the council has decided to suspend it indefinitely. Orefete is a very peaceful community, but recently youth have taken advantage of the two masquerade festival to allow unleash violence. Hmm. Ifani Ejofo has been seen as the em Bullness of violence. Ah, now wow. In the community, he recruits youth who he use for these things. We don't blame the youth because one we see him as a model. Oh, what he use his keys for these days does not settle well with us. So we have abolished 
the festival. Uh -huh. Now we are seeing where the problem is coming from gradually. When this day reach, he find in age of four, he denied the allegations describing the leaders of being a maker of false lack keys. He said, those accusing me of any wrong do not represent the voice of Orefete community, but they are simply a maker's puppet who the hand pick for his selfish interest and personal bubbling. Community leaders accusing Adekanu's lawyer of encouraging insecurity in Anabra State. Case closed. Now, I want to also talk about this issue to drop my two cents. Hey, you guys know that a lot of things has been going on, but the truth is, there is nothing anyone is doing on earth that there is no reward. If you are doing good, there is reward, and if you are doing bad, there is reward. I want to bring your mind back towards a lot of accusations that has been happening recently. When this thing was coming up, when he raised the alarm that his life is in danger, people are threatening his life, blah, blah, blah. A lot of people were just pointing, accusing fingers on the Biafra Prime Minister, which is the person of Simon Ekba. Reason being that both of them have their own bass bills, you know, their own katakata before. And when this news broke out, a lot of people were saying, oh, yes, he's the cause of insecurity. He's Simon Ekpa, is this. There is not even including Barista Ifa Ejofo as accused Simon Ekpa, time without number, of being the brain behind the insecurity in Biafra land. We all were here when a lot of people will be raising alarm. Anything they say, they say, oh, it's Simon Ekpa. Simon Ekpa is the one that have boys. It's Simon Ekpa boys and all that. So many talk, so many allegations. All of a sudden, Barry Stafa is your first said, no, it's not Simon Ekpa. It's his kinsmen. Ah, they are the ones that are in charge. They are the ones that are causing insecurity in the land. They are the ones that are causing problem in the land. They are the ones that are giving him a dick. Oh, it's not that person. Blah, blah, blah. Ah, I say for real. Okay, now, the community elders, the traditional ruler that he accused of being the brain behind his life threat, they are not coming out to tell the world that, oh, you people don't really know Barista Ifa in Joffre. He has some boys that he's training. You know, this issue has happened before. I don't know if you forget. Ah, I always remember that he has some boys that he's training, that he is the brain behind the insecurity in Biafra land. Hmm. See, in every nonsense, there is a sense. In every nonsense, there is a sense, and a lot of media houses is not carrying it, saying he is the brain behind every katakata that is happening. They say that at the end of the day, he will buckle himself, saying that he's IPOB lawyer. So, my wonderful family, I say, let me bring this information to you, if you haven't heard it before. Because the people that uh, Barry Safai Jofo accused the other day, the people are not calling FG, security agencies, DSS, that they should look into the matter of Barista Ifa and Jofo and make sure they bring those people to book. And those people are not saying that. They are not the cause. They are not the problem. They don't have any problem. Barista Ifa and Jofo is the one causing confusion, please. <laughs> Where do we go from here? But anyways, just trust progress the analysis that we keep on giving you all the updates. Meanwhile, this is just on board. This is everything that is happening right now. A lot of Nigerian media houses is everywhere. They are carrying it that, but this is what they are not talking about Barista Ifa in Asia for. So, I tell let me bring it to you so that it will not look like you are drawn out of the game. So, what is your talk on it? Do you really think that what they are saying, the accusation, everything, do you think that is right? Please drop your opinion in the comment section because eh, more details will be given to you sooner that you expect it. Thank you so much and do it to share this video, like and subscribe. I still don't mean one and only progress the analysis. I give you the update back to back. Thank you so much and bye bye.